What's going on people? Just down the beach at low tide. Just having a look around really. I wanted to check up on the weeds. Was thinking about lure fishing. But it's pretty, I don't know, a bit choppy, water's still a bit murky. A bit of a breeze in the air, so I don't know, not ideal situation to fish. But yeah, I just wanted to do a bit of exploring really. So I'm just out here, I'm just gonna start looking for the rock balls. Have a look around, see what we can find. Maybe head over to the pier, see how that is. But yeah, just having a wonder really. Off to a good start, people. Just realised my welly of five years, it's now got a leak. But <laughs> can't complain, it was only a tenner. And these wellies have probably last me the longest I've ever had wellies. Absolutely crazy, I can't believe um, they last that long, considering I wear them every trip, wear them all the rock pools and stuff like that so i don't really worth i don't know for me it's not worth spending loads on like boots and things like that because they never seem to last no matter they're good or bad they don't last okay the first rock i littered up i did find a nice little rock lin a nice little squat lobster in here somewhere here's a squat lobster Not a bad size one for a bounce here. Normally a bit smaller than that, but look how long its arms are. That one can go back. But there was a little three bearded rockling somewhere. I think he might have gone under my shoe. Yeah, they did. Where'd he go now? <laughs> there he is. Got loads of those around here. But just always remember to put your box back and how you found them. Just in another one swimming around. Camouflage so well. Where's he gone? But I can guarantee you that's what all the bass and all the codling are being caught are feeding on at the moment. But yeah, let's see what else we can find. Okay, I think this one might be a little porcelain crab. It's got really fat pinches, what size though? Did make me think, are you gonna focus? There you go. Did make me think it was maybe like a little small edible crab. But yeah, that's a little porcelain crab. That's a quite a big one as well. I'm sure I just saw an eel, little bootlace eel somewhere around here. Oh, there he goes. Nope. What was that? I think there's another free beard of rock ring. Where's it gone? Yeah, not too sure where that went. Just coming up to quite a good rock here. Looks like it's going to hold something by the expense. It's quite flat, so normally it means there's ledges underneath it. I'll see if I can lift it back and have a show. I saw a vagworm just came up on this flat rock. If you look how much they move in the water. Not too sure how much you can see in the glare there. But they wiggle around quite a lot. And if you look down there, it's a little rock gobby. Speedy little thing. But you can see all the little barrels here, which the fish and creatures come in. Good little hiding spot for them. Big flat rock, so we put that one back down. Yeah, I'm sure I saw like a velvet uh, crab around there. Not too sure where it went. They can be quite vicious, these crabs. I don't know. I'm sure it's died out from underneath the rock. Yeah, crabby, crabby. I think he could be a goner. It's also quite good just filming the ground around here. Massive sand bar all along here. Got a shallow line of rocks. It's just all sand. There it goes through. Another set of rock pools here. But, yeah, I've been fancying uh, lure fishing around here. 
So I think that I might try and get that in sometime next week because uh, officially I'm off work for a week now and the kids are going back to school. And I can't wait. Been a long six months with them all at home, I'll tell you that. But yeah, back to the rock balls. Let's see what we can find. Another little bagworm there. You know, we'll go away for me. Should have brought a little bucket with me. Normally I'll bring a bucket with me when I go through the rock pools and stuff. But you can just see the movement they give off just in the water. That one's not going crazy, but still it's more in a normal sort of lugworm and stuff like that. There's little things like that, all the flatfish and bass and stuff look for. Another tiny little rockling there. Speely little things when I get going. But the fish have definitely got me feeding them. There's been hundreds of them around. Literally so far every rock I've lifted up there's been like a little rock underneath it. It's getting a bit closer to the pier. I don't know that I'll get there by the time the sun goes down. Don't know how much uh, tide's left as well. I think it was about low tide about half seven today and it's about half seven now so it's going to be turning any point so I might be able to go underneath there. There you go guys, that's what's been in the rock pools. These little rockling. Normally you get them in the beginning of the year, not so late in the, not so much in the autumn, but obviously it's a sign of what's to come. Give it a little release. And yeah, I just can't believe how many of them are about. It's definitely worth um, maybe trying some lures, uh, dark in colour. All the minnows and stuff like that. It's probably worth giving it a go this time of year. I'll show you the water quality. Got wet feet already, so I suppose it don't matter too much or get too much wetter. But this is ankle deep and it's quite cloudy to be honest. But see the clarity, it's probably 10 inches deep or so, and yeah, you can hardly see the bottom. Oh, now I've just got a hole in my other blooming. Yep, <laughs> you guessed it. Wet feet and both now. Tide's starting to come in quite quick. You see the end of the pier there and how much it's going up the beach. I'm going to keep heading that way and see how far we get. I think this is a little winkle. It's got some really nice colours to it. It's got purple, blue. Quite decorative. Not too sure, is that a snail? I don't know. I'm not too clued up on all these sort of little shells. Give me a splash in home. Sound like fish jumping in. It's a weird. Mm, that's just the waves. It's just the waves hitting the weed. But it definitely sounds like a fish jumping out of water. Keep my eye out. There okay. you go. I think that's a large claw porcelain crab. It's going to try and bite me. Try and nip my finger. Don't know how much it's going to hurt. Please don't pinch. Yeah, I'm going to check it out. I'm going to put it back down again. <laughs> this looks like a really good rock to this. You can see underneath there all the finer little stones. That normally means like a big crab or something like that has gone underneath it and kicked it all out and gone underneath it. So I'm going to give that a lift and see what we can find. Nothing that time. But you can see like the mound. They're just for sand, it's like a little burrow that I think it's left wherever it was. Starting to find all this long, stringy weed. Look how long that is. That's attached to a rock. That's got to be about five foot high. But the second we get any more rough weather, that's all going to shore. And yeah, seems to be quite a lot of it around. 
Same for all this. It's all quite fresh, but it's not the strongest on the rocks. It'll come up quite easily. And that will be coming to the shore as well. Not far away from the pier now. But the end's under the water, so I won't be able to have go underneath it. There used to be like a, um, like a big dead man rock around here. Um, yeah, it was like a big sheet of metal or something. I can't remember exactly what it was. But it used to hold all sorts, loads of little fish and decent crabs and things. But I'm not too sure what it was. I've been down there for good six months or so. Don't know that it would have moved in any of the storms or anything. But just having a look about. Um, won't be long until I'm going to have to stop because I haven't got any torches with me. And it was, I was supposed to be just going for a walk and I thought I'd just show you, show you what it's like at low tide around my local beaches and where it. Um, I'm going to have another look around see if I can find this rock structure and see yeah, what else we can find underneath it. I think I'm just too late. I think it was just around here. But it goes down welly deep there, if not a bit more. So I can't get there. But the tide's coming in quite quick. The light is fading as well. I keep walking around. Sucks with this cloud, see? Just the second the water's coming in, it's literally clouding up straight away. So I don't know. Don't know what that means to us fishing guys. Right guys, my last little find. Little shore crab. See it's quite dark now. My camera's not in focusing. So I'm gonna be calling that one my last little find. Surprisingly that was the only shore crab I found. Normally there's a lot more than that, so that's a bit weird. You can see the pier nicely lit up here. The wheel in the background, got the amusements there. The Connaught and the Dome Cinema. And that is Worthing Beach pretty much. It's like this, ground, both sides. All the way down to Ferrin, Little Hampton, all that way. All similar sort of ground. So yeah, and right over distance, where the lights are going out. That's Bryson. You probably see the red light right over distance. That's um, Sean Power Station. So that's right over by the arm there, where I normally fish. But yeah, that's the sort of ground I tend to fish on. And this is the ground I want to try and fish a bit more. But parking's a bit of a pain around here. But you can do evenings and stuff, so if I get the tide right, I might give it a go. But yeah, something a bit different. Just a bit of a random video, me waffling a lot. But I'm going to hopefully get out a few times this next week. Might do some late night tides. Um, might try a little Hampton way as well. So yeah, that's that's my plan for this week. Well, I hope you enjoyed this little video. Um, give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Um, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Uh, click the bell notification as well, and that will notify you every time I upload. And I'll see you very soon, guys. Thanks for watching.